guys. I got a corner for a takeout job today. So we'll take this completely out. So for a video as I'm doing it. And then last year I had to maintain that edge behind. It took about six foot out of it. It was really high. But they want another four foot taken out this year now. And I'm gonna do something on them trees over there. So I think that'll be next week. I'll be starting on that back edge. I don't know about that, that tree. Let's see how it goes. I'll start by here now with a pole saw. Just dig my way in. Good thing is I can park the van right there. So it's easy. Just chuck the stuff straight in the back. Same as when I do the back edge. I just pull on the grass by here. Just my thrown over the wall then. I always start with a pole saw and stuff like this. Just to make a bit of an opening. Get all the leaf out the way. See the thicker stuff in. To get in here with a normal chainsaw. Right, just getting into it now. But I find it so much easier using a pole saw. I'm trying to get in with arms, normal saw. I do most of this with this pole saw now. Might be on the thicker stuff down, down further. So as you can see, I just work my way in, and then once you threw all this leaf in, it was a lot easier. Just taking them out then. Still, I've messy about today now. Just one go, so I gotta run over now for my Esky 372. I'll chuck some stuff in the van now and uh, can get it. It's always something, isn't it? So I have to look into that. I'm surprised how much waste you have from doing a job like this. I think that's what catch a lot of people out.
take this off now. Same. It's a bit off anyway. Come down a bit more with that one, maybe. So they the weather too. Stone, eh? That's all right. Well, there we are, guys. End result. I'm happy with that. Took about four hours, mind. Of moving all the stuff as well. Got a full van load. All right. So, like I said, I'll be doing the back edge next week. Look out for that video. There we are. Please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Cheers.